on the left click on campaigns and click on the blue plus button scroll to new campaign and click it to begin your campaign select a goal in this example our goal is to sell ebooks we're going to choose sales next we must choose a campaign type in this example we're going to choose search we're looking for buyers who have their credit card in hand. They're currently searching to buy the subject of your ebook or digital product. Our goal is to appear on the top of the search. Google is the number one search engine. We will have many chances to reach your buyer. Click on search. Click the box for website visits and input your business website. Click continue. Give your campaign a detailed name. Scroll down to the network section. You may choose to include Google search partners. This include websites or blogs who partner with Google outside their network. This also includes apps. We're going to leave the boxes checked to extend our reach. Scroll to the next section and choose the start and end dates. If you want your campaign to be ongoing, leave the defaulted no set for end date. Go to dynamic search ads settings and input your domain. We're going to use the default settings for select a targeted source to use Google's index for your website. Scroll down to locations and select the locations you want to target. If you're unsure of the locations to target, we can do a little research. Go to google.com and search for Google Trends. Enter the topic of your book. In this example, the topic is start a trekking company. Press enter. On the left, on the top of the page, we see the defaulted United States location. You can choose to widen the interest, clicking the drop down menu and clicking on worldwide. Scroll down to interest by region and you'll see the list of countries you can market to. Choose a country, for example, the United States. Scroll down and look at the interest by subregion. If you want a more specific target, you can choose to target the states listed. You also use their information when you're creating Facebook ads. To research further, go to Facebook Audience Insights. Click on Go to Audience Insights. You may choose to target everyone on Facebook or people connected to your page. For example, we'll choose everyone on Facebook. If you have more than 5,000 Facebook followers, you may consider targeting both by creating on campaign for everyone on Facebook and the other campaign for people connected to your page using Facebook ads. On the left side, go to interest and input the topic of your digital product. In this example, our target audience are drivers who have an interest in starting a business. In the interest section, we're going to enter entrepreneurship and truck driver. To the right of the page, click on location. There you'll see cities where people are more likely to purchase your digital product. You can also widen the search by including the countries you found on Google Trends. Then narrow the search again by city. Go back to Google Ads and input the locations you've chosen to target in your ad. In this example, we'll leave it at the United States. Scroll down to budget and bidding to enter the average you want to spend each day. 
In this example, we'll input $20 per day. Set the daily budget you can afford. Scroll down to bidding. In this example, we want to focus on conversions. Continue to scroll down to the conversion section. Select the conversion action you've previously created. Scroll down to add schedule, leave it to the defaulted option all day. Leave add rotation to prefer best performing ad. 